Mama, my dad. <laughs> At least you know you you can visit now. Yeah. <laughs> my girlfriend, you have to cry. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> What is good, YouTube? It's your boy, 20 on the towel. And I'm back with a big, big, big video today. Highly requested. Today is the day that I leave for year three of my professional basketball career. And I'm headed off to Germany. It's never easy leaving. Never, ever at all. She said, <laughs> my family said, but hey, I gotta do what I gotta do. This is my job. Everybody understands. I'll be back soon. So, but yeah, I'm um, I'm gonna take you guys through a day of like traveling and just traveling overseas. Kind of hectic, long flights, layovers. Luckily for me, I don't have a long layover. But yeah, so stay tuned. We got a good one in today, and yeah. Right, y'all so i just arrived at the airport i'm on the shuttle bus right now taking me to my um terminal where i'm going to be departing at Whew, this is about to be stressful like my second time going overseas is i got a lot of bags that i gotta carry by myself um but yeah i'm gonna keep y'all updated I'm about to check in my bags and i'll, I'll uh, update y'all from there so i just arrived at the airport got all my bags with me but as y'all already know we're going through a little pandemic right now so i'm having a little trouble checking in and validating uh you know my information and the reason why i'm going to germany you know they don't believe that i'm going to germany to play basketball so i had to show a whole bunch of documents and um yeah uh it's just a little hectic right now so hopefully we can get everything cleared up so stay tuned if not i don't know what's gonna happen i've been texting the people the team you know in germany and I got all the information they said I needed, so they're verifying right now because, you know, the virus has everything just, like, really restricted. So stay tuned. I'll keep y'all updated. Whew, that was just so stressful. But we uh, finally got cleared to go through security and finally board my flight. It's really not nothing I really ever went to. I've been overseas twice, and this is nothing I've been through before because we weren't going through a pandemic. But now that we're going through a pandemic, where uh, we have, they have extra precautions they have to take in order for people to, you know, travel. So, yeah, I'm about to say goodbye to my family. Um, bye, mom. <laughs> this is the hard part. <laughs> my mom, my dad. At least you know you you can visit now. Yeah. <laughs> my girlfriend, you have to cry. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Don't worry. Don't worry. Temporary. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey, just got through security. All good to go. About to head to my gate. Um, the hardest part about, you know, being a professional basketball player, especially when you go overseas, that you got to leave your family behind, you know, so... My brother, you know, my two brothers wasn't here today. Uh, and another little guy that I've been missing dearly wasn't here today uh, <clears throat> because of reasons beyond my control. So, but regardless, you got to get out your comfort zone to, to get to the bag. And that's really all I have to say about that. But about to head, back, head to my uh, gate and, um, you know, just chill until my flight. This stuff's been crazy because of the virus and stuff like that. So it's just, I've never been through that when I went through anything. When I was going through Spain, when I was going to Greece. And yeah, stuff's been crazy because of the virus. So y'all stay tuned. I'm going to keep y'all updated. Um, right now, I'm about to fly from Chicago to Dallas and then Dallas to Frankfurt, Germany. Keep y'all posted. Peace. Empty all 
all your pockets and put it in your hand luggage because that's how you easily forget those stuff to fall out your pocket. So empty your pockets first off. Before you even get on the plane, I should have said this earlier, before you get on the plane, grab you something to eat, some hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. Because once you get in another country, you're gonna be susceptible to like jet lag and you need a lot of water and fluid. So hydrate, grab you something, grab you a snack or something. Entertainment, you know, just keep yourself entertained and just enjoy the experience. I'm gonna keep y'all posted. I'm about to head out to Dallas and yeah. Some of y'all see that you know when you have a flight the team will try to get you the cheapest flight possible so the cheaper flights actually have longer layovers i'm actually blessed to have a two-hour layover but yeah from here i go straight to frankfurt germany and then from frankfurt germany i drive like two two and a half hours to the little city i play in get again so yeah just checking in about to give me some more water you know do some some editing on my other youtube videos and Get on this next flight. Uh, tune into that new that 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 YouTube video as soon as y'all done watching this one, cause it'll be obviously uploaded. So yeah, stay tuned. I'll hit y'all in a little bit. Your boy is about to board the plane to go to Frankfurt, Germany for the first time ever, and I'm excited. It is time to finally board. Yeah, gotta get my passport out and my boarding pass, and it's time to go. I'm gonna see y'all on the plane. Uh, about to 
go through immigration right now, as you can see off the long line. About to get stressful, but I'm gonna keep you all posted and updated. Uh, yeah, I'm ready to get back to the apartment, but gotta go through this first and get my uh, COVID-19 testing as well. So yeah, stay tuned. All right, so that wasn't as stressful as I thought. I flew through immigration, actually. They ain't even asked for much. Um, grabbing my bags right now. And we about to go COVID testing. And then the team's gonna pick us up. I keep saying us, my teammates right here. I just met them. Um, and then I don't know what we're doing after that, but I'm gonna keep y'all posted like always. See y'all soon. Finally got through the virus testing. That was very stressful. I just had to carry all these bags up like two flight of escalators and then find the testing site, which was just, I don't know, far. But finally did it. I was sweating my ass off. Like, I'm good now because I've been sitting down, but gonna wait for the limos to pick us up. And then, I mean, in the meanwhile, I'm probably gonna find something to eat and prepare for this two and a half hour drive to where I play at. So yeah, that's the rest of my day. Grab me some KFC. I don't really eat KFC, but it's either that or McDonald's. So I decided to pull up here. No kidding, I'm not even trying to eat this, but I'm hungry. So I'm about to just smash this real quick. I'm not eating no coleslaw. This is this is a pro tip. Anybody who eat coleslaw, do not trust them. Cause that that's wild. But the rest of this is valid, I guess. I don't really eat this, but whatever. Finally here in the city that my team is in, get again. Uh, drove myself. It's the car they gave me. I'll make another video on that later, but I'm excited. I'm about to show y'all where I live, where I'm living at and um, how the house looks like a little bit for a brief moment. Cause I'm gonna make a little video on the house as well. But yeah, it's a pretty nice neighborhood. Taking the name, and let me show y'all inside. This is my apartment, laundry room. Let me show y'all the brief moments of the rooms. This is the guest bedroom, bathroom. It's a hallway right here. Kitchen, got a patio, pretty nice, nice scenery. Uh, let's see, this living room, and this is my bedroom. And there you have it. Um, didn't say this before, but before I got here, I actually took a tour of the facility that I'm practicing at. Very nice. It's actually, I'm not gonna lie, it's probably one of the nicest facilities I've ever seen, ever. Very nice, it has everything in it. But yeah, just, I'm in my apartment now. Uh, today was a very long and hectic day. Uh, as you can see, 
capacity for all the hoopers that want to play overseas. Um, this is probably one of the better uh, flat itineraries I ever had. Not every flat itinerary is gonna be as smooth. I consider this smooth because it could have been worse as far as layovers and type of flight or whatever. But um, yeah, one hour drive to the airport, uh, two and a half hour flight to Dallas, my two and a half hour layover, and then 10 hour flight to from Dallas to Germany, then another two and a half drive from Frankfurt to get again where I'm at currently. Um, I finally settled in. I'm gonna probably get some rest. Actually, I don't know. I'm not even tired. I probably go to the gym or something, work out, get something to eat, relax, settle in, unpack all my things, and get ready for the season. Um, got a lot of a lot more videos coming y'all way. Got a lot of ide ideas I want to share. A lot of things I want to share. Um, I thank y'all for tuning in. If you got value from this or you enjoyed it, please like, comment, subscribe, and share the video. And until next time, peace.